pledge your vows to each other and as you commit your lives to each other. We ask that you do so in all serious and yet with a deep sense of joy, with a deep conviction that you are committing yourselves to a dynamic, growing relationship, trust, mutual support, and caring love. Now join your hands right to right and left to left. These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you, that are holding yours on your wedding day, as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours, as together you build your future. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will hold you when fear or grief fills your mind. These are the hands that will countless times wipe the tears from your eyes, tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These are the hands that will, that will help you hold your family as one. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And lastly, these are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged, will still be reaching for yours, still giving you the same unspoken tenderness With their eyes locked and their hands linked, you, dear ones, now see the beautiful symbol of the union of two hearts, two lives, and two souls. I understand there are rings. <coughs> A circle has no beginning and has no end, and so, in the long and sacred tradition of marriage, rings have come to symbolize eternal love and endless union of body, of mind, and of the spirit. They have been given by lovers to each other as tokens of faith, trust, and hope, as well as a tangible sign of a promise given and kept through the days of their lives together. We are here to witness the making of this promise and the giving of all the intangibles of their heart and spirit, love, trust, faith, and hope, not just in each, in each other, but also in their union. Chelsea and Jonathan are making a declaration before all of you that from this day forth, they are united before the world in a promise that spans the years of their lives. And as we witness their covenant to each other, we are all reminded of the promises we've made in other times and other places to the people we've chosen to love and cherish. It is also a beautiful opportunity to refresh our love for our beloveds, renew our commitments to our mates, and remind ourselves of the continuity of life. Jonathan, take the spring, place it on Chelsea's finger, and repeat after me. I, Jonathan Paul, take you, Chelsea Nicole, for my wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do us part. Chelsea, take this ring, place it on Jonathan's finger, and repeat after him. I, Chelsea, Nicole, take you, Jonathan, Paul, for my husband, to have and to hold from this day forth, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do us part. <laughs> 